in this video i will tell you how to fit paragraph text when you have uh, too much of uh, text to display and uh, your text is going out of the the uh, page area so uh, suppose i have this title it this can be any title so for this video i have put the title fit paragraph text okay so let's uh, first uh, copy some large text so that we can uh, paste something on the uh, paragraph block so uh, here i have some document let's just uh, copy the first paragraph for now and let's jump to this and uh, we'll create a paragraph block like this and it will show me the uh, cursor bar okay so this this text is uh, fitting very properly let's increase the font size so that the text run out of the block let's increase it further let's make it uh, 24 so now i can see that my text is exceeding then the size of the paragraph block like this you will see this uh, icon with an with a downward arrow which indicates that that there is more text to the uh, downside of this paragraph block and it is exceeding the uh, text that can be fitted into this shape so what we will do is uh, the traditional method will be like uh, you either uh, reduce the font size or try to expand it like this and make sure that it fits or there is another way in corel draw let me just show you uh, for this we will create another paragraph text block like this right next to it you can even uh, reduce the space also that is not the problem that is entirely dependent on the requirement of your project so uh, now i have two uh, two paragraph text blocks first one is the one which have some data second do not have any data and is completely blank what we want to do is uh, we want the the extra text from the first block to fit in automatically in the uh, next paragraph block that we have created so for this uh, what we have to do is press shift on your keyboard uh, select the first paragraph text block like this and uh, select the other paragraph text block like this or you can simply you know uh, highlight the blocks and they will be selected automatically uh, so uh, then uh, you go to this op option from the top uh, which says text uh, in the text uh, there is a uh, option for paragraph te text frame and it will sh it will show you a list of options simply click on an option which says link this link and uh, let's click it then i will tell you what it will do as you can see that uh, the extra text that we th that uh, that was not being f fit in the uh, early in the first paragraph block is now moved to the next paragraph block so uh, so that it can be displayed on the screen and let me just you know remove uh, reduce the font size so that it fits properly now the entire text is fitting on the screen you can see very clearly that there is no downward arrow in this case because there is no extra text and uh, this icon now shows that the text is moved on to another uh, paragraph text block and you will also see this arrow which indicates that there is a relationship between this paragraph block with this paragraph block okay so uh, simply if you just want to uh, remove this link and uh, you want to cut out some text and you do not want this paragraph block simply uh, select both these sorry select the uh, pick tool highlight the text blocks go to the text go to the list of options with the heading paragraph text frame and in the paragraph text frame go to this option unlink it will it is just right below the link option Just click on unlink and they will be unlinked and uh, uh, now your data will uh, now the extra data that you will put here it will not go there because 
we have unlinked it and you can simply you know click delete this entire block or you can move the text from uh, this this block to this block so this way we do it and if you are wondering why these uh, dotted lines are visible in this paragraph text block then th it is the default setting default option selected in the settings so if you want to uh, remove this uh, dotted dash the uh, boundary of the paragraph block simply go to tools options and there will be an option for document under document there is an option for uh, no in uh, under workspace heading there is a subheading with the text you will see an option which says uh, there is an option for paragraph click expand the list of options under the text and in the paragraph you will see that show text frame option will be selected just simply uncheck the block and your uh, dash boundary will be gone like this and this setting will uh, will be saved until you change it next time so you will not see the text frames next time you uh, create a new project or you work on something else so uh, that is it for the video if you have any query use the comment section below to ask any questions uh, please do click on like button do subscribe and uh, do check out other videos on corel draw and uh, if you are if you are uh, new to this corel draw then try to you know uh, get get some basic idea of the corel draw and uh, use the playlist to browse my videos so guys uh, that is it for the video see you see you next time bye bye